like to call to order the Finance Committee meeting for October 11th, 2022 at 5.30 p.m. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Attendance roll call. Alder Persons Wolf. Here. Hamill. Here. Kabaki. Here. We have a quorum present. Thank you. Statement of public notice. This meeting has been noticed in accordance with the public meeting law. Thank you. Approval of the minutes from September 27th, 2022. Move to approve. Second. Discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? That passes. New business. Recommend approval to purchase playground equipment for Vets Memorial Veterans Memorial Park. Move, Move to approve. approve. Second. Discussion. Cam, you want to, or, J or Scott, or I'll someone want to come up and explain excited. what we got going on here? <laughs> yeah. We did. It was improved. We got it all. So in the memo, Tammy got us a great grant, just to let everyone know, as you can see on there. But we have to purchase it by November 1st uh, for the piece of equipment. It's the main big piece of equipment, all right? Um, but this allows us to maximize dollars, and, and we worked with our vendor, and we pretty much did it in three days that we got this grant for $86,000, which is kind of nice. Um, the other thing, too, it allows us to start planning for, we're going to be doing our first community build. Um, we also figured that will save us $35,000. Um, myself and Ryan have started reaching out to local contractors uh, who might be interested to be a project manager on this job. Um, we were hoping to do that uh, and get that done in like a weekend. So um, I gave you also a rendering of the big main large piece of equipment, and that's the, the piece that we are getting. The other thing, too, is if we wait after November 1st, the grant goes away, and they nail us with a 10% increase because uh, prices are going up by everyone. So, Any questions or comments? Are we obligated to buy the larger piece of equipment? The grant was <laughs> so the grant was awarded on that piece. We had to pre-pick a piece that we would want, and then the grant was awarded. They cost match. That's what the grant was. So if we don't take the grant, we don't get that piece, and we get no money. So if we have the piece that we you originally looked at, would there still be a grant available? No. No. No, and we haven't looked, we hadn't looked at any pieces. We got a postcard in the mail saying they had a $5 million grant program, and I just started going in and looking at inclusive pieces big enough to fit our site so that we could have the beginnings of the process of an inclusive playground. So I went for something a little bit bigger, knowing that the rubber surfacing that will happen at that site it's going to be about $150,000 install construction. I kind of just backed up to $200,000 piece, hoping that we would get half of it matched, and they matched us at $85,000 or $86,000. Does that make sense? It, it does. I guess my, my only concern is that if we had an original idea of what we wanted, we went bigger, if we can go back to the piece that we looked at and still get a grant for a proportionate amount of money and bank the difference. And the reason, the only reason for that is that there's a lot of expenses coming up for park projects. And I thought this might be a nice little bank account that we could start. Sure. So this we budgeted and where we requested in capital $425,000 for this playground. We didn't have any pieces predetermined. We just knew like, the general idea of what would go inside the park and what those playground pieces cost. So the grant is only good till November 1st. They may have another grant next year. We could go in for a smaller piece and try and price match it. But if we don't use this money now, we don't get it. That's okay. a guarantee. All right, gotcha, thanks. Any other questions or comments? So what did you say again that we had budgeted for this? 425,000. Okay. We don't plan to go in over 425,000. You know, we're not we're not asking for any more money. We're just yeah. want to purchase. That's what I saw. That's just not what I heard. So yeah. I just wanted to, okay. Yeah, Thanks. and remember, too, we have American Legion working on raising about $20,000 as well to 
provide some benches and some shading. And why we're trying to do the community bill too, to save us $35,000 so we can put more money into it, um, the actual playground. Right. So we're, we're trying to work every angle we can to maximize everything that we can for it. So, and we're willing to offer anyone else wants to donate stuff. Um, we have a two to five year old set. It's a perfect one that you can come and raise funds for. Um, but we have plenty of ideas if anyone wants to come and help us raise funds for parks, kind of like Ali did. So, so with the larger piece of equipment and the cushioning that's required, we'll still be under the hundred or four hundred and twenty-five thousand. Correct. That's our goal. We are not asking for any more money. Okay. Further discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Thank you. Recommend approval of a letter of credit reduction for PHW Muskego Inc. Presbyterian Homes. Motion to approve. Second. Discussion? It's just a normal. Yeah, I just want to make a comment. I want to make sure that the houses behind are taken care of for as much as we can with the flooding that they have from the. Uh, the runoff. I know Scott and I talked, and a while. I just want to make sure we make sure we get done what can be done before occupancy or anything. We've been out there checking a lot. Um, I know Alderman Hamill and myself has talked a couple times. Um, we have been reaching out to the people to the south or to the east if there's been any drainage. Um, things are coming along. The person last time I reached out after September 11th storm, I asked her to the east and she said everything's working really good. That wasn't the case before, but now as the buildings come along, the gutters are now being connected. More, the parking lot is in for the first part. As the parking lot gets in the bottom part of the, the building, more things are going to the pond. Um, I showed you the extra thing that they're gonna try to do to the south of the berm of the pond. We hope to get that in place, and then before any occupancy, I'll, I'll make sure Ryan and I will go out there and, and then talk with the neighbors to make sure everything's looking okay. Yeah, because so. you know which ones I'm talking yeah, about. Yep. There's those two that are affected. There's two that are affected. That are so, affected yep. a lot. Yep. Yeah. And I just want to be clear that one of those homes, for sure, had problems that were worse right. before this. So this isn't, yep. we can't make them fix problems that they didn't create. Exactly. I just want to make sure it's not. Yeah. Not worse. No, I, you, I, you, I, when you're I, there, you can see it is right. It's low. Yes, but he's got a low spot to start with. There's yeah. we can't ask Presbyterian Homes to go on his property and build it up. Right. No, exactly. Okay. Yep. All those in favor, say aye. Aye. Opposed. That passes. Recommend approval of public improvements for road for. Road for Glen at Muskego, oh, for the road for the Glen at Muskego Lakes LLC. It's just worded weird. <laughs> Move to approve. Second. Discussion? Any questions? All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? That passes. Voucher approval. Motion to approve utility vouchers in the amount of $256,950.75. Second. Discussion? All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? That passes. There are no tax vouchers. Motion to approve general fund vouchers in the amount of $527,417.77. Second. Discussion? All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? That passes. Motion to approve wire transfers for payroll invoices in the amount of $383,947.45. Second. Discussion? <laughs> All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? That passes. Finance director's report, there is none. Communication miscellaneous business as authorized by law. Otherwise, a motion to adjourn would be in order. Motion to adjourn. Second. All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? We're adjourned at 539.